is still gone, hasn't it? Everything. Everything that I knew, it's... It's not here anymore. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do anymore. Done with my other chores. Woman, you'll be the death of me yet. Fine, take your time. <coughs> Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. What's through there? Oh, yes, she did want to talk to us, didn't she? Close the door. We've been waiting a while. Now we can talk. Oh! What's this? The Book of the Dragonborn? Those blessed by Akatosh with the dragon blood became known more well, simply as Dragonborn. So, so Akatosh. It's the blessing of Akatosh himself. The true meaning of being dragonborn. The connection with dragons is so obvious that it has almost been forgotten. In these days when dragons are a distant memory, we forget that in the early days being dragonborn meant having the dragon blood. Some scholars believe that was meant quite literally, although the exact significance is not known. The Nords tell tales of dragonborn heroes who were great dragon slayers, able to steal the power of the dragons they killed, yes. Yes, I can do that. Indeed, it is well known that the Akaviri sought out and killed many dragons during their invasion. Oh. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. Oh. I hope they're right. Yes. Yes, yes, they're right. I hope so, but you'll forgive me if I don't assume that something's true just because the Greybeards say so. I just handed you the horn of Jurgen Windcaller. Yeah. Does that make me Dragonborn too? Of course not. Anyway, why did you take it? Why did you take it to get me here? It was the only way I could make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am Thalmor. not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Okay. Okay, go on. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. I'm not very old. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Ugh. Trust me. How can I trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Ah. Right. So why did you take my horn? I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were Dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeards sent, and not some Thalmor plant. Well, I'm not exactly an elf, am I? How can I be a Thalmor plant if I'm not even an elf? And, wait a minute, you said that you're looking for the Dragonborn. Why? We remember what most don't. We. That the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. You are the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Yes. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? 
Oh, yeah. That's how I first learned I was dragonborn. Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Prove it to you? Why do I need to prove anything? What aren't you telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. Right. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. What makes you think that dragons are coming back to life? I know they are. It's nuts. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty. And I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Oh, you better. So where are we going? Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. Okay, I haven't killed a dragon for a while, so let's go, get, go and kill a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. What? That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. Orgnar, I'm traveling. You've got the inn till I get back. Right. Happy trails. Kynes Grove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. Look at horse. Look at horse. It's attacking! Well, it's a dragon! It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Dragon doing. Dragonborn. Yes. And what do you say now, huh? I owe you some answers, don't I? Don't Go ahead. Apology. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Who the hell are you, and what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very are. long time ago, the Blades were dragon slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest dragon oh. slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. 
Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. I was looking for a purpose as well. And so you're going to be serving me. Makes a change. It used to be the other way around. I used to serve other people. Hmm. Who's Blades? Exactly. Nobody even remembers our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone, though. For the last 200 years, we've been searching for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. Right. That, what just happened there, I've not seen that before. That's a bit odd. And, and that black dragon, he spoke. He, he was the one that, that, that brought that other one to life. What do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Uh, I think. I think I've seen that dragon before, that one that got away. Really? Where? It was, it was, I think it was the one that must have attacked Helgen. It, it, you know, it flew over me when I was out in the woods and it was headed to Helgen and then Helgen was all burnt down. So, I think that was the same one. Interesting. Same dragon. Mm. Damn it, we're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. You reckon that there's someone behind this? Not, not, not just the dragons decided to come back or anything. All right, so what are we going to do? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Mm. Okay. But why why would they why would they bring the dragons back? Nothing solid yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm not up to, to all the political stuff that's been going on, but that doesn't really make much sense to me. How are we going to find out what they know? I mean, do we know any guy else? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, oh. it's the center of their yeah. operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Right, that doesn't sound like a good thing. So how are we going to get into the Thalmor Embassy then? Mm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. What? This is all a bit weird, Lydia. But I, I can't, de yeah, I can't deny that that that, that big, that big black dragon, and he came down, and the 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 dragon grave it like exploded, and and it was a ghost, and then it wasn't a ghost. Maybe the Thalmor do have the answers. But at least I know at least I know that it was Akatosh who gave me Dragonborn powers. It wasn't Sithis or Meridia or anyone like that. So we go along with what she said. She's supposed to serve me. I wonder how many there are. Does that mean I'm gonna have lots of servants? Are you getting a 
bit wet, shadowy. But then you live in a pool, so that shouldn't be so bad, should it? I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. Oh, Me? Was a hero named that was quick, wasn't it? Are you sure you don't want to take more time and come up with a plan where both of us go in? I've been doing this a long time, remember? While the Thalmor have been looking for me, I've been watching them. Okay, so what's your plan? What's your plan for getting into the Thalmor Embassy? The Thalmor Ambassador, Ellen Wynn, regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. Right, I can get you into one of those parties. Oh. Once you're inside the embassy, you can get away and find Ellen Wen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? This is a While you're doing that, game. I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things Ragnar with Melbourne. Any questions? I thought you said that you had a way of getting me in, and now you say that you've got to sort out a way of getting me in. Which is it? How am I going to get into this party? Let me handle that. You'll have a real invitation, don't worry. As long as you can act the part of a Thalmor toady, you'll get past the guards. Right, except that I, I'm not an elf, let alone high elf, and I used to be a servant, so I'm not used to behaving as though people should be waiting on me. Don't take that, though, as an excuse to treat me like a servant. I'm not sure that my acting skills are going to be up to it. <sighs> say they are up to it. And I get into the embassy. And you say secret files? How am I supposed to find secret files in a big embassy? Because they're really, really big, aren't they? And they've got lots of rooms and there's lots of people. And they must have loads and loads of files. So, get in, get to the party. But what am I supposed to do then? That's when the fun starts. You'll have to slip away from the party without raising the alarm. Then you'll need to find Ellen Wynn's office and search her files. Melbourne should be able to point you in the right direction. Okay, okay you are leaving it down to basically Melbourne and me. And all you're basically doing is getting it in the right. Right, okay, I'll see you in solitude for the invite when I've spoken to Melbourne. Maybe you'll have a bit more info. You should see me when you get bored, stranger. How's it coming, as you want
remind us of our place when we forget. This... this is Akatosh. This is... this is the one. Let us walk in the steps of the Divines. I'm, I'm glad that we had to come to, to Solitude because... This is, this is the place to find out about, about them and, and according to the book, Akatosh is the one. others no. may knowledge of your divinity carry us through our daily trials As, as Lydia, as, as a dragonborn, it's my duty to find out, because I'm a dragon slayer, it's my duty to find out why the dragons are coming back, because I've got to protect Tamriel. So we've got to find out what the Thalmor know, because we've got to find out why the dragons are coming back. And who's bringing them back? Because I've got to stop it if it's dangerous. Born of being here. Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Can you see an elf somewhere? You're not an elf. Oh, I see him. What do you need? Hi, Malborn. Our mutual friend sent me. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Right, okay, um, except that I don't know the layout or where anything is, so I hope you're going to be a little what even to do, because we don't really have a plan. I assume you know Delphine, and it's a bit up in the air. Go see Malborne, she says. He'll have more information than I've got. And here you are, you're sitting there saying, oh, it's up to me. Well, that's no good, any, is it? So this what am I going to... So what am I going to need? You're asking me? She promised that she was sending someone who knew what they were doing. If you actually want to get out alive, I'd bring whatever you need to move quietly and kill quickly. Oh. Believe, believe the dragonborn comes. 
It's an end to the evil of all Skyrim's foes. Beware, beware, the dragonborn comes. For the darkness has passed and the legend yet grows. You'll know, you'll know, the dragonborns come. Yeah, uh, whatever it is, I have to do it, don't I? Cause, cause I need to, cause I need to protect Tamriel. Okay, I'll give you some stuff. Oh, I wish I hadn't sold the assassin stuff now. Right, looks like I'm going to a This party. is an ode to Skyrim's staunch protectors. The Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Oh yeah, he's yeah, yeah, he's all set. Though we could both do with a little bit more information about what we're supposed to be doing. Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You better. You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. <laughs> okay, Shadow Mia. You're behaving yourself. Are oh, you making friends? Oh, okay. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Oh, cheers. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Elinwyn, the Falmor ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? My name's Lilia. I, I'm very pleased to meet you. Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, tell me more about yourself. What brings you to this... <laughs> to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the Arinthia Red? Of course. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you distract the guards, I'll open this door and we can get you on your way. Okay. Let's hope we both live through this day. These storm cloaks are nothing more than an armed mob. This war won't last much longer. I couldn't agree more. By the way, have you heard any Hello. interesting rumors? Isn't this something? Ellen yeah. really knows how to host a party. Are you enjoying it? Very much so, yes. Ellenwyn's parties are always so elegant. She really has impeccable taste. And my only regret is that she doesn't host them more often. There's a likely looking filly, even if she is an elf. You there, serving girl! What's your name, dear? Ah, oh, Braylister. Do you need a drink? Something to eat? No, no, that's not what I'm interested in right now. I just wanted to get a better look at you. I like what I see, my dear. And believe me, I don't say that to everyone. I'm very discriminating when it comes to the female form. Isn't this uh, something? Oh, thank you, sir. Oh, really knows Was there anything else I could do for you? Oh, not at the moment. Maybe later. When I married Torek, he promised yes, we'd go to lavish parties just like this. I wish you were here now. Yes, that's, that's very much a pity. Helen Wen always throws quite a party. I never miss one if I can help it. I saw you eyeing that serving girl. Hmm, yes. Brayless, is that the one? I hope you're not thinking of cutting me out, are you? <laughs> I'm warning you, when I get my heart set on something, I'm not easily put off. Maybe I can... Maybe I can talk to her for you, see so if she's interested. You know, girl to girl. Really? Yes, maybe that would be just the thing. She seemed to be playing hard to get when I spoke to her earlier. Go on. See what she says. Now you've gone and gotten my hopes up again. 
What can I get for you? It's a bit crowded. I'm getting jostled all the time. Anyway, that fellow over there, he's a rich one. He asked me to talk to you. Oh, Eric, right? He was yeah. talking to me earlier. I could yeah, tell what he was after. I hate uh, working these parties. Some of the guests are nice, but there's always a few like Erica. Please tell him to leave me alone, politely. I'm sure you'll have better luck getting through to him than I would. Oh, I'm not sure about that. I don't know just what you mean. Heard anything interesting lately? Um, really, because maybe it's... Well, well, I did see something well I'll give it a go, but I'm not sure. There were several Good day. ...outside the walls of White Run. Seems they've been traveling around the whole of Skyrim putting their wares. You've got to admire their courage. Oh, there you are. Have you talked to Braylus yet? I I'm have. not a patient man, you know. Well, I can I can see that. Yes, she said. Um, very much. She said she can uh, she can sneak you up to her quarters right now. Actually. Ha! <laughs> I knew it. No woman yet born has been able to resist my charms for long. Thank you, my friend. I owe you one. Is the food and drink I feel right? You must have misunderstood. I'm must not have permitted to leave the I mean, met a oh, few I women. Think so. I think I understand them perfectly. Don't worry, my dear. I won't make any necessary excuses to you. No, I'm sorry, but I can't go anywhere with you. I won't. Please, I must get back to my duties. Don't you dare walk away from me, you slut! Do you know who I am? Let's go, let's go, before anyone notices us. So far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. We need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking, got it? Follow me. That's a bit cruel of me to do, but I'm sure she can handle herself. You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Yeah, it's all right, work rules, in kitchens. is it, Zabani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Come I, on. I know if a someone few misses recipes. me at the party, we're both dead. Hurry it up. I've got to get back before I'm missed. I can wait. I know just what you mean. Heard anything interesting lately? Any news or I need to lock the door behind you. The patrols might notice something's wrong. But lately it seems like every blacksmith is scattered. Did you see those robes? You're on your own this morning. Who are they with? More of the emissary's treaty enforcers? No, they're high mages, just in from Alan. I guess himself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how to defend this place. We have other informants 
Now, I have work to do. Leave me to it if ever you want to see the rest of your payment. Can I... I could help you. He talked to me. In the cell closest to your office stairs for your convenience. Okay. dark as to the cause and meaning of the return of the dragons. So they want Esbern, because he's a dragon law expert. So they want Esbern to find out why the dragons are coming back. Oh, and in R Riften, okay. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender immediately, or you will die. That takes care of that. Now the Thalmor will be hunting me for the rest of my life. I hope it was worth it. Well, the idea is to stop the dragon attack, so um, unless you don't think that's worth it... I should have known this would end badly. I can't believe I let Delphine talk me into this. Yeah. Hello, mate. You don't look too good. I told you. I don't know anything else about it. Um, I didn't come to talk to you. What? Who? What? What do you want, then? Um, well, I'm not sure, actually. Um, I'm going to let you go. Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Come on, this way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead somewhere. Okay, I'll just need to get these bindings off you. Anyway, go on, I'll follow you. <sighs> Whatever you want. But let's go, now. I don't think I can go back out the front entrance. Come on, Melbourne. Gone on ahead of us, Melbourne. Stop. Exits this way. You didn't have to help me, so thanks. Well, I've been in tough positions myself. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, 
Oh, you made go. it out alive, at least. Your gear is safe in my room, as promised. Did you learn anything useful? Well, um, the Thalmor know as much as we do, actually. They, they don't know anything about the dragons either. So it was a pretty pointless trip. Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that? Yeah, no, yeah, I'm sure. They're, um, they're actually looking for someone who might know something um, called Esbern. Esbern? He's yeah. alive? Oh. I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. That crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying no, to find Esbern. out what's going on with the dragons. Yeah, he said to sum it about um, dragon law, so that would be why the Thalmor want him. It's dragon law expertise or something. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Yeah. Esbern was one of the blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Yeah, they... Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't Thalmor as crazy did. as we all thought. No, that's why the Thalmor would want him. Um, um yeah. So, basically... They think that the blades know something about the dragons. Ironic, right? The old enemies assume that every calamity must be a plot by the other side. Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. He'll know how to stop the dragons if anybody does. Do they know where he is? Yeah, they reckon that he's in Riften. Riften, eh? Mm. Probably down in the Ratway, then. It's where I'd go. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjolf. He's well-connected. A good starting point, at least. Oh, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. You'll know what it means. Oh, all this cloak and dagger stuff. I, know, I might be able to find him without talking to this person that you know. I... Waiting as they have done time and time again for a dragonborn to return, for one to protect, for one to guide them. I'm not sure how much guidance I can give them. But I am the dragonborn. Right, okay, we need to go to Riften. Find some bloke. And I know just the place where we can ask. The best place that we can look for someone who's hiding is um, down where we went before, where we saw Delvin Mallory, the the, um, the ragged flagon, I think they called it. Ready to brave that again. to keep on your guard. Pe the people who live here can't live in town. Delvin. I'm listening. I'm, I'm sorry to tell you this, Delvin, but Astrid's dead. Um, and we've had to move to Dawnstar. 
Um, it, it was abandoned, so it needs to be repaired. I'm not going back there some any time soon. Um, but if I give you some money, will you be able to to repair it? It will cost you a yeah. lot, but I can help you out. What exactly are we talking about here? Got a lot of nerve coming down here. People tend to get hurt in the rat way. Uh, yeah, they do if they cross me. Um, I'm looking for an old guy who's supposed to be hiding out somewhere here. Huh. A lot of old guys around. I don't really know how I can help. Oof, I know something that might help your memory. I think I do know the old guy you're talking about. He's holed up in the Ratway Warrens. Hardly ever leaves the place. Has someone bring him food and such. Crazy old coot from what I've heard. For that to stand out down here, he must really be off his nut. Right, uh, so it doesn't sound like Delphine's kidding then. Be careful. You're not the only one looking for him. Thanks, mate. All right. Just the way. Dirk. Seems to be it. Are you as are you as Ben? They were golden, even when they were dead. But their blood was red. I knew it would be. If you are as Ben, then I I I, I no. don't Never think you'll fire. be of much help. Come here, come here. 
Come here, come here, come here. Okay, um, unless he's had to change your career, I don't think that's as bad. I'm warning you, back off. Oh, now that looks like the door of someone who's paranoid. Go away! Um, Esben? Um, can you open the door, please? I need to talk to you. What? No, that's not me. I'm not Esben. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes. Uh, yeah, I don't believe you. Anyway, Delphine sent me. Delphine? How do you... So, so you yeah. finally found her, and, and she led you to me, and here I am, caught like a rat in a trap. Um, look, I, no, no, I've not come to trap you or anything, but I'm the one that you blades have been looking for, I'm the Dragonborn. What's that you said? Dragonborn? Yeah. Then there really is hope after all. You'd better come inside, quickly now. Delmore agents have been seen in the ratway. Yeah, no, I killed a few. Oh. This will just take a moment. This one always sticks. There we go. Only a couple more. How many blocks have you got? Yes. Book. Yes. Bucket. Yes. Ink No. There we are. Come in, come in. Make yourself at home. Come back. Go away a minute. Okay. That's better. Now we can talk. You, Dragonborn. Yep. Is it really true? Well, yes, yes. I am. And Delphine think, seems to think that it's important to you somehow. Important? Far more than even she realizes. Um, if you are Dragonborn, then. Yep. <laughs> there is hope. After all, for so long, hope. all I could do was watch our doom approach, helplessly. Doom and hope. Why, why am I thinking that's a bit more than just dragons? Dragons, pah! They can be killed. The blades yes. killed Dragons. many in their early days as dragon slayers. I've killed them. No, the dragons are merely the final portent of the end of days. End of days? What, like the end of the world or something? Oh, yes. The prophecies make clear the signs that will precede the end times. One by one, I've seen them fulfilled. Aldwin has returned, just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time, who devours the souls of the dead. No one can escape his hunger, here or in the afterlife. Aldwin will devour all things, and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. Wait a minute. Alduin. Is that that big black dragon, the one that's been raising the others? Yes, yes. You see, you know, but you refuse to understand. I'm not refusing. I'm trying my really, really, really hard. Um, I, I read the prophecy in the Dragonborn book, and it was a complete... It was gibberish. But I know Alduin, and I'm going to get that. Alduin, because he burnt down my home. So it's not hopeless, because I'm here. You're right, I forget myself. I've lived without hope for so long. The prophecies are clear. Here. Only the dragonborn can stop Alduin. Oh. We must go quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. But give me just a moment. I must gather a few things. I'll need a... No, no, he was just trash. Right yeah, there are quite a few locks that you've put on the door. What are you doing? Look, look, come on. Yes. I, I know, I know, I'm hurrying. <sighs> One moment, I know time is of the essence, but I must leave secrets for the Thalion. One more. Well, I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. Well, I hope the thing was important. Um, I killed off a load of Thalmor, but I don't know how many are down here. Uh, that wasn't me. I, I'm not 
I'm certain about that, Chef. <laughs> no, never oh, fight. Don't want to know about that. But, um, Esben, I'm, I'm not entirely sure about the way out here. Nice. Well, apart from yes. Mm. Book. Yes. Bucket. Yes. Down more up there. There's another one up there. Oh, Maybe they have, might have a bit more sympathy for Helgen now. <laughs> and if they don't, maybe I should have let the dragon burn a few buildings. Excuse me. Delphine. <laughs> I, it's good to see you. It's been a long time. It's good to see you too, Esbern. It's been too long, old friend. Too long. Well, then. You made it safe and sound. Good. Come on, I have a place we can talk. Orgnar, hold down the bar for a minute, will you? Yeah, sure. This way. I hope she pays you well, because it seems like you do all the work. Now then, I assume you know about... Oh, yes. Dragon Ball. Indeed, mm. yes. Oh, this changes everything, of course. There's no time to lose, so we must locate. Let me show you. I know I had it here somewhere. We packed Esmer, everything. What? We packed Give everything. Me just a moment. Um... <sighs> ah, here it is. Come. You see, right here, Skyhaven Temple. 
constructed around one of the main Akaviri military camps in the Reach during their conquest of Skyrim. Do you know what he's talking about? No. Shh! This is where they built Ordwind Hall to set down and stone all their accumulated dragon lore, a hedge against the forgetfulness of centuries. A wise and foresighted policy in the event. Despite the far-reaching fame of Aldwin's Wall at the time, one of the wonders of the ancient world, its location was lost. Esbert, what are you getting at? You mean, you don't mean to say you haven't heard of Aldwin's Wall? Either of you? Let's pretend we haven't. What's Aldwin's Wall, and what does it have to do with stopping the dragons? Aldwin's Wall was where the ancient blades recorded all they knew of Aldwin and his turn. Part history, part prophecy. His location has been lost for centuries, but I have found it again. Not lost, you see, just forgotten. The blades' archives held so many secrets. I was only able to save a few scraps. So you think that Alduin's wall will tell us how to defeat Alduin? Uh, well, yes. But there's no guarantee, of course. Skyhaven Temple it is, then. I knew you'd have something for us, Esbern. I know the area of the Reach that Esbern's talking about, near what's now known as Karth Spire, in the Karth River Canyon. We can meet you there, or all travel together. Your call. Um, I've got a horse. Your call. Might be safer to travel separately. Attract less attention that way. Don't worry, I'll get Esbern there in one piece. We'll wait for you near Karth Spire. Good luck. You'll wait for me? I've got a horse. Orgnard, this is it. The inn is yours. I'm probably never coming back here. Well now, that's something to think about. Take care of yourself, Orgnar. Goodbye. Yeah, sure. You too, Delphine. You be safe. Well, I think you deserve it. I think you did all the work anyway, so... Good job, mate.
Oh, Mark, but I'm gonna go up quick. Lead on to Skyhaven Temple. Right, so it's over here. Okay. These look like the Forsworn. This temple that we're going. What, up there? I think we're getting close. Let's keep moving. Hold on. Who's there? This looks promising. Yes, definitely early Akaviri stonework here. We've got to get this bridge down. These pillars must have something to do with it. Oh! Yes, these are Akaviri symbols. Here, let's see. You have the symbol for king and warrior, and of course the symbol for dragonborn. That's the one that appears to have a sort of arrow shape pointing oh. down. That one. I know. I'm Dragonborn. Yes, born. that's it. <laughs> the symbol on the middle pillar. <laughs> Dragonborn for me. Oh, you did. It worked. Let's see what those old blades left in our way. What? I was, I was actually being a bit vain. Wait. Why are you stopping? We should be careful here. See these symbols on the floor? Hmm. Esbern's right. Look like pressure plates. Be careful. Oh, well. They're the same as before, aren't they? Safe. And there's there's a path of these dragon ones. Goes all the way across. Be careful. Yeah, goes all the way across. We'll cross once it's safe. And da da. Safe. Let's move. Yes, yes. I think we might be close to the entrance. Wonder what would happen if you stepped on the wrong one.
Oh, one minute, wait for me. see who th it's a temple but I can't can't see who they're worshipping Dragon. We're here for Alderman's wall, right as well. Yes, let's see what's up ahead. Well, where do they put a wall? I mean, there's lots of walls, obviously, but it's got a great big, huge wall with graffiti on it, or lots of writing. I can't see one. Be in a room somewhere Shows off the side. Here it is. Aldrin's Wall, so well preserved. Huh? I've never what seen a final example of early second era Kavir has gone through in relief. Esmer, we need information, not a lecture on art history. What that? Yes, it's just a picture. Yes, let's see what we have. Picture of a dragon. Burning someone. Look, here is Aldrin. This panel goes back to the beginning dragon. of time when Alduin and the dragon cult ruled over Skyrim. One minute, Alduin beginning of here, time. The humans rebelled against their dragon overlord, the legendary dragon war. Alduin's defeat is the centerpiece of the war. How you see, the here is fallen from the sky. The Nord Tongs, masters of the voice. Are arrayed against him. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Ah, patience, my dear. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory and mythic symbolism. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? Hmm? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific to dragons. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all they knew of Alduin and his turn. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. Have you ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? Well... No. But... I haven't actually been really good with my studies. I was afraid you were going to say that. I guess there's nothing for it. We'll have to ask the Greybeards for help. I hope to well, avoid involving them in this, but we why? have no other choice. Why? 
the 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 greybeards know all about shouts, and and shouts is what dragonborn do. So surely you should get on. What have you got against the greybeards? If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the civil war or done anything no. about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? Why would they be afraid? Because they're, they're, they're be better at shouting than I am. So, I wouldn't worry about that. I mean, they're far better than me. I, I'm not afraid of my, my power, and, unless there's something about it, I don't know. Good. The Greybeards can teach you a lot. But don't let them turn you away from your destiny. You're Dragonborn, and you're the only one who can stop Alduin. Don't forget it. Why would they? Why would they try and turn me away? That, that seems a bit odd. I'll go and see if um, I'll go and see if Arnge knows what the shout is then. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Not likely they'd help Esbern or me if we came calling. The prophecy which brought the Alkaviri to Tamriel in the first place, in search of the Dragonborn. Here are the Alkaviri, the blades. You see their distinctive long swords. Now they need their ancient mission fulfilled, as the last Dragonborn contends with Alduin at the end of time. This is all about, like, stories and... What did he call it? Allegory or something? I don't get all that. came back because I need to learn the shout that was used to defeat Alduin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Well, it's recording on something called Alduin's Wall. The Blades, of course. Yeah. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Well, Their reckless got... arrogance you knows no bounds. They have stop... always sought to turn the Dragonborn <sighs> from the path of wisdom. Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the Blades to be used for their own purposes? Well, the Blades want to defeat Alduin, and so do I. Don't you want to defeat Alduin? What I want is irrelevant. Oh. This shout was used once before, was yes. it not? And here yes. we are yes. again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Well, Those well, who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. Let what? it end and be reborn. I didn't, no, no, I'd rather it didn't. I'd rather it didn't look like end now. You know, even another postponement that would be good. So, oh, so you're not going to help me? No, not now. Not until you return to the path <sighs> of wisdom. Oh dear. Dragonborn, wait. Uh, forgive me, I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my judgment. Master Einarth reminded me of my duty. And the decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. Right, does that mean you're going to teach me the shout then? No, I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. Oh. It is called Dragonrend. Okay. But its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. 
So, so what am I going to do then? How, how can I defeat Alduin and stop the world ending if, if, if there's no shout? Only Parthenax, the master Parthenax. of our order, can answer that question. The master? If he so chooses. The master of your order. Well, I, I thought there were four of you, but okay, I need to speak to him then. You weren't ready. You still aren't ready. But thanks to the blades, you now have questions that only Parthenax can answer. Well, clearly. So who is Parthenax? He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his, his mastery master. of the way of the voice. Okay. Why well, haven't I met him then? He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. Okay. So he's uh, on the Top of the top of the top of the mountain, so how do I get there? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, uh okay. Is, is that the way, then, to the top of the mountain? The path to Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. Okay. Well, that's his privacy, then. Lock. Oh. Ah. I will grant you my understanding of clear skies. This is your final clear gift skies. from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Clear skies will blow away the mist, but only for a time. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. Look 
look at that view. It's almost, we're almost high enough to touch the moons. Parthenax. There's a wall there. I can't see a house. Oh no, it's to get me dragon. Dremulok. Greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. Um... Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? Oh, wait a minute. You're the master of the Greybeards? They see me as master. Wuth Onik, old and wise. It is true I am old. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Well, I've got to learn the dragon wrench out. And, and the Greybeard said that you, you'd be the one to be able to teach me. Can you teach me? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. Two of the Dove? Two dragons? By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dova King. I have spoken. The Rotmulag waits. Oh, the word. Um. The word calls you. Go to it. They all call me. A gift, Dovakin. Yol understands fire as the Dove do. Show me what you can do. Greet me not as mortal, but as Dova. Yo! Ah, yes. Sosedo Vrostmul. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. You don't talk to dragons. So, you have made your way here to me. Yes. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sos, dragon blood. What would you ask of me? I, I need, I need you to teach me the dragon wrench out. Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Timvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Obviously. What do you mean you're expecting me? How did you know that I was going to come for this shout? Alduin Komet Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovakin return together. Alduin and Dovakin. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind 
Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. But the Greybeards don't know it. Is there somebody else then? I, know, I thought that Greybeards knew all the shouts, but is there somebody else that I need to go and see? How, how am I going to learn it? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this, Thum? Because that Alduin, he burnt my home down and I need to stop him before he burns the entire world down. I need to stop him, and to stop him, I need that shout. Yes, Alduin, Zembach. The elder brother, gifted, grasping, and troublesome, mm. as is so often the case with firstborn. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? Well, because the prophecy says that only the dragonborn can stop Alduin. Mm. True, but Kostid, prophecy, tells what may be not what should be. Does that make a difference? Kostid Salo Ak. Just because you can do a thing does not always mean you should. Hm. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez, of fate? Well, I thought destiny... I thought destiny was a was it was a good thing, and and I hadn't had one before, and and it's good, it's good to have a destiny because that means that I have a purpose. So, isn't isn't is that the best reason, destiny? If you can see your destiny clearly, your sight is clearer than mine. Dahman, remember, Alduin also follows his destiny as he sees it. Uh. But I bow before your certainty. In a way, I envy you. The curse of much knowledge is often indecision. You saying I'm sick? But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus. Now, I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? To, well, to keep out of people's way, I presume, because otherwise people come and, come and kill you, and, well, dragons like mountains, don't they? True, but few now remember that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. Was he? Varucht Unsad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Yeah, but that was using the dragon wrench out, wasn't it? Hmm. Yes and no. Viknuznikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. Well, yes. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. Again, yeah. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin. But this good. was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. Ooh. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Elder Scroll. What's an Elder Scroll? Hmm. How to explain in your tongue? The Dove have words for such things that Jaw do not. It is an artifact from outside time. It outside does not time. exist, but it has always existed. Rahwatlan, they are mm, 
fragments of creation. The Kelly, Elder Scrolls as you name them, they have often been used for prophecy. Yes, your prophecy comes from an Elder Scroll. Do I need that scroll then? But this is only a small part of their power. Zofa Suryek. So you're saying that Elder Scrolls exist outside time and they're really, really powerful. And the ancient Nords used an Elder Scroll on Alduin and what? They 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 pushed him forward to to where we are now? Not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. May ye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Yes. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I thousands. have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Okay. So, what's this all got to do with me? Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to okay. the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to... Cast yourself back to the other wow. end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Oh. Do you know where it is then? Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. You are likely better informed than I. I only really know two people who do a lot of reading and stuff and have lots of knowledge, and that would be Esben or Ongir. Trust your instincts, Dovakin. Your blood will show you the way. Okay. How could an Elder Scroll sort of throw up Alduin forward in time? Vormendark, I do not know. Perhaps in the very doing, they erased the knowing of it from time itself. The Dove are children of Akatosh. Thus, oh. we are specially attuned to the flow of time. Perhaps also uniquely vulnerable. I warned them against such a rash action. Even I could not foresee its consequences. Nust Lihon, they would not listen. So, Akatosh, I get to... Are we related? Wait a minute, were you there? Yes. There were a few of us that rebelled against Alduin's Thur, his tyranny. We aided the humans in his overthrow. But they did not trust us, ni of. Their inner councils were kept hidden from us. I was far from here on the day of Alduin's downfall, but all Dove felt the Sundering of time itself. Okay, so what does this Dragon Ren shout actually do? I cannot tell you in detail. I never heard it used. Kogan. It was the first Thum created solely by mortals. Oh. It was said to force a dragon to experience the concept of mortality. 
a truly von Mindoran. Incomprehensible idea to the immortal Dove. You're all immortal? But, 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 killer vulcus. Oh, I should mention that. Okay, so. Okay, so I've got to find an Elder Scroll. Um, and then what? What do I do with it then? Return it here to the Teed Ahran. Then. Kele Vomindok. Nothing is certain with such things. But I believe the scrolls bond with the Teed Ahran will allow you a. a seeing, a vision of the moment of its creation. Then you will so feel no dragon rend in the power of its first expression. You will see them, Uthfadon, my friends, Haken, Gormleth, Feldir. Friends. Haken, Gormleth, Feldir. That, that, that sounds like Lord name. That sounds like human names. Who are they? The first mortals that I taught the Thum. The first tongues. The leaders of the rebellion against Alduin. Oh. They were mighty in their day. Even to attempt to defeat Alduin. Sahrot Hun. The Nords have had many heroes since. But none greater. Oh. So you're not like the other dragons at all, are you? You're a different kind of dragon. And, and we we re we related because because Akatoshi gave me gave me dragon blood, and so I'm part 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 dragon like you. I'll I'll find this Elder Scroll because because we've got to stop Alduin. Look through. Look through. I, I need to get that Elder Scroll. I, I'm glad. I'm, I'm, Lydia, come on. Okay, um... Let's see if Angin knows where there's an Elder Scroll. Parthenax. So, you spoke to Parthenax? Yeah. The dragon blood burns bright within you. Did he tell yes. you what you wanted to know? Did he teach you the dragon wren to shout? Yeah, but he doesn't know it. Um, he did tell me how to find out about it, though. So be it. If he believes it is necessary for you to learn this, we will bow to his wisdom. It seems I need um, an Elder Scroll, the one that um, the the ancients used. Um, you don't happen to have it or know where I can find it, do you? We have never concerned ourselves with the scrolls. The gods themselves would rightly fear to tamper with such things. As for where to find it, such blasphemies have always been the stock and trade of the mages of Winterhall. Oh. They may be able to tell you something about the Elder Scroll you seek. Oh, mages. Um, okay, now, I don't suppose there's another way to defeat Alduin, is there? Perhaps not, but this shout was used once before, was it not? Yeah. And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Oh, no, I haven't Those considered Those who that overthrew at all. him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If well, the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. It can end in the future, but not today. Sky, guard you. 
thank you. Um, we, we've got to find some mages. Ooh. I know. Ah! Dragon. Oh, it's that one. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Okay. Let's see here. I have a letter here from Quintus Navale in Windhelm. He said it was urgent. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Who's... Who's Quintus Navale? During Norellian's convalescence, I've been studying the legends at the file. I don't know enough of enchanting to make one anew. But with the proper materials, I may be able to repair the original. Please come see me as soon as you can. That was that really useful file. You know, that broken one that we found. We... Let's, let's find out where this Elder Scroll is first, okay? Because that's really important that we stop the end of the world. Cross the bridge oh. at your own peril. The way okay. is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. But, but I need to, I, I, I need to guess, why are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. 
And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important question is, why are you here? Um, may I enter the college? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? I need to find out about, um, the Elder Scrolls. Do you? Yeah. It is true, there are some here who have spent years studying the accumulated knowledge of the Scrolls. But what you seek does not come easily, and can destroy those without a strong will. <laughs> it would seem that the College has what you seek. The question now is, what can you offer the College? Um... Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. Oh. A small test, if you will. Wouldn't you grant entry to the Dragonborn? Dragonborn? Yeah. It's been so long since we've had any contact with the Greybeards. Do you really have the voice? Yeah. I would be most impressed to see that. Oh, okay. And... No! That gave me the of course! So the stories are true. Yep. Yeah. You are Dragonborn. Yep. Yeah. Normally, you'd need to show some aptitude with one of the schools of magic, but you... I think there is much that we can learn from each other. Mm -hmm. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Addition Welcome, the apprentice. College. apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabelle Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. I don't want to learn magic. The college is an asset to Skyrim, even if it goes unnoticed or unappreciated. Oh. That's where the rest of the town is. It's not good. Much knowledge lies within the college's walls. I, I only need to know about the Elder Scroll. Okay. Where am I going to find out about the Elder Scroll then? I believe I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. Um... Hello. Welcome to the college. Yeah, I was told to come and see you. Um, Another new student. No. I'm surprised at how many of you there no, are I'm lately. Not, I'm, I'm, I'm well, not a new student. first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more I... to your liking than your current clothes. These I'll give you a brief to tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. I don't want to Are you get ready to, to begin? No. I see. Well, please let me know when you are. Okay. Um. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You oh. all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Oh, and what are we waiting too. for? Let's get started. I'm not, please, I'm not please. Actually, this is exactly what I'm talking about. I'm not actually Eagerness here must be to do with magic. Caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet oh. so far. What do you think we should do? 
I don't know what to think because I'm not actually here to do the magic. Not going to weigh in either way? Well, no. I admire your restraint, but there are times when you must make decisions, even without all the facts. Oh. Rely on instinct. Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? Um... Yeah, I, I, I've got a ward spell. I picked that up somewhere along the way, but I've, I've never used it. That's what this lesson is for. Perfect time to try it out. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. We're all pretty new at this, right? Let's just give it a chance. What's the worst that could happen? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. Okay. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want yeah, anyone here. else in the way. Yeah. Now, oh, cast right. the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Excellent work. Ooh. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthol nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. I, I, I didn't come here to... I, di I didn't... I, I didn't come... I didn't come here to learn lessons. I need to... I need to find out about an Elder Scroll. It's always encouraging to see the younger generations embracing education. Jezargo continues to struggle with wards. You have time to practice? Is there anyone if you're here who know? Need something? Uh, yeah, hello. Um, I believe you're the librarian. Um... And, and, and I'm looking for an Elder Scroll. And what do you plan to do with it? Do you even know what you're asking about? Or are you just someone's errand girl? Well, well, yes, because the dragon told me all about it and I need one to save the world. Do you have one? You think that even if I did have one here, I would let you see it? It would be kept under the highest security. The greatest thief in the world wouldn't be able to lay a finger on it. Well, well, that's glad to know. Um, but what about the Dragonborn? I'm, 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 I'm the Dragonborn. What about? Wait, are you? Yes. Were you the one the Greybeards were calling? Yes. I'll bring everything we have on them, but it's not much. So don't get your hopes up. It's mostly lies, leavened with rumor and conjecture. Okay. All that's right. Good. Then. Here you go. Try not to spill anything on them. Oh, thanks. Um, Mr. L Mr. Librarian? Mr. Librarian? I don't want... You are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Um, yeah, uh, it might be because I haven't learnt any, any magic, but that, that Ruminations book, um, I didn't understand any of it. I... That's the work of Septimus Cygnus. He's the world's master of the nature of Elder Scrolls, but, well, he's been gone for a long while. Too long. Where'd you go? Somewhere up north, in the ice fields. He said he found some old Dwemer artifact, but, well, that was years ago. Ugh, haven't heard from him since. Do you think he'll know where there are any Elder Scrolls? Because 
I, he, he, he seemed to know a lot about them, even if I couldn't tell that he did, because I didn't understand his book. Mr. Librarian? Should I go and find him? Yes. Thanks. See what he knows about this elder scroll. Um, hello. Hello, excuse me. When the top level was built, eh? no more could be placed. It was and is the maximal apex. Ah, you sound like, like, like your book, so you've got to be Septimus. Um, I heard you know about Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls, indeed. The Empire, they absconded with them. So they think. The ones they saw. Ah, the ones they thought they saw. I know of one. Oh. Forgotten. Oh, Sequestered. Okay. Yeah. But I cannot go to it. Not poor Septimus. For I, I have arisen beyond its grasp. I don't understand what you mean. Um, where is it? Here. Well, here as in this plain, Mondas, Tamriel, nearby, relatively speaking. <laughs> On the cosmological scale, well, it's all nearby. Okay, so, um, can you help me to get it? One block lifts the other. Septimus will give what you want, oh, but you yes. must bring him something in return. What do you want? You see this masterwork of the Dwemer, deep inside their greatest knowings. Oh. Septimus is clever among men, but he is but an idiot child compared to the dullest of the Dwemer. Lucky then they left behind their own way of reading the Elder Scrolls. In the depths of Black Reach, one yet lies. Have you heard of Black Reach? Cast upon where Drimmer City slept, the yearning spire hidden learnings kept. <laughs> uh, um, I have no idea what you're talking about. Where is Black Reach? Under deep, below the dark, the hidden keep, Tower Mzark. Oftan, the point of puncture, a first entry of the tapping. Delve to its limits, and Black Reach lies just beyond. But not all can enter there. Only Septimus knows the hidden key to loose the lock to jump beneath the deathly rock. Um, I, I understood only a couple of bits of that. How do I get in? 
two things I have for you. Two shapes, one edged, one round. The round one for tuning. Dwemer music is soft and subtle and needed to open their cleverest gates. The edged lexicon for inscribing. To us, a hunk of metal. To the Dwemer, a full library of knowings, but empty. Find Mazark and its sky dome. The machinations there will read the scroll and lay the lore upon the cube. Trust Septimus. He knows you can know. You, this, there's something that will put whatever's on the old Elder Scroll into this cube for you. Okay, what do I do with this sphere thing? The deepest doors of Dwemer listen for singing. It plays the attitude of notes proper for opening. Can you not it's hear it? Mm. Too low for hearings? It's a key. And this 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 cube um and this this cube this this is going to record what the Elder Scroll says, yes? To glimpse the world inside an Elder Scroll can damage the eyes or the mind as it has to Septimus. Yeah. The Dwemer found a loophole, as they always do, to focus the knowledge away and inside without harm. Place the lexicon yes, into their contraption and focus the knowings into it. When it brims with glow, bring it back and Septimus can read once more. Okay, I think we can do that. Dig, Dwemer in the beyond. I'll know your lost unknown and rise to your depths. Okay, now the Dwemer runes um, he, he spoke of, I think they're over there. were doing some digging somewhere but it wasn't here maybe this is an earlier dig or it's someone else or something oh. yeah I don't I don't think I don't think this is to do with the college
something's been going on here. wondering whether Septimus actually is mad or whether he knew this was actually going to be pretty dangerous and that's why he didn't go himself this is this is this is where we heard the people person journal talks about eyeless creatures and he talks about the metal things like they're different there's some sort of strange creatures that live in one of the ruins or something
Why do I think that they're not being killed by those metal spider things? And I don't think the metal spider things would make those barriers. And I don't think those people did either. Those eyeless creatures that got read in the journal. going down. Get out of here. Hasn't there been enough death? Of course you want me to leave. Just waiting for me to turn my back. So you can have all the glory for yourself. Is someone there? What? What? Do you like 
How do you like the new armor? Okay, so. There are more of those funny, weird-looking creatures in here. of a mountain. some sort of contraption. Oh, and the body. Got to press some buttons or something. 
something. down here okay right let's get this cube back to Septimus to thank him for helping us with getting that scroll. I've got your cube thing. I've got your cube for you. Dig, dwemer in the beyond. I'll know your lost unknown and rise to your depth. Well, hopefully when the, the top level was built, eh? no more could be placed. It was and is the maximal apex. Yeah, you said that last time. Um, I hope your cube will help because I've done it. Give it quickly. Extraordinary. I see it now. The ceiling structure interlocks in the tiniest fractals. Dwemer blood can loose the hooks, but none alive remain to bear it. A panoply of their brethren could gather to form a facsimile. A trick. I don't know what you're talking about. Something they did not anticipate. No, not even them. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer, Dunmer, Falmer, and Orsimer. The elves still living provide the key. Bear you hence this extractor. I... It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when its set is complete. Look, thank you for, for helping us with the Elder Scroll, but I'm, I'm, I'm a bit busy to, I don't know, go around draining elves of blood and stuff so I'm, I'm sorry you're gonna have to find someone else to do it oh but can you get out of my way come closer bashed in my presence I thought I'd seen the last of you I've been watching you and 
I'm not replacing another one. Once that infernal lockbox is opened, he will have exhausted his usefulness to me. Well, I hope it takes him a long time then. When that time comes, you shall take his place no, as won't. my emissary. No, I won't. What say you? No, absolutely not. I am not your servant. I mean, you, uh, to, you tricked me into defeating Mirak. I mean, yeah, fine, but no, I'm not. Up I am not your servant, and I'm not going to replace yet another one of your people. Be warned. Many have thought as you do. I have broken them all. You shall not evade me forever. I must only try my best. I'll oh, certainly put a dampener on things. Alright. Oh, well. Alright, mountain. Yes. The Kel, the Elder Scroll. Yes. Tidkrich, Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. There is no question. You are doom driven. Kogan Akatosh. The very bones of the earth are at your disposal. Go then, fulfill your destiny. Take destiny. the scroll to the time wound. I was right. Do not delay. Alduin will be coming. He cannot miss the signs. Okay. Is that it there? Where all the snow's a bit odd. Oh, yes. No thought beyond the blooding of your blade. <laughs> what else is there? Battle below goes ill. Faldun does not rise to our challenge. I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why does Alduin hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours, old man. He will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us even now? Plotted him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone. But none have yet stood against Aldo and himself. Both Sori, Birka. They did not have Dragon Land. Once we bring him down, I promise I will have his head. You do not understand. Aldo cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why. Brought the Elder Scroll. 
Veldir, he agreed not to use it. I never agreed. But if you are right, you will not need it. No, we will deal with Alduin ourselves. Hear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches! So be it. have mercy on our souls. Oh. I'm looking, not keep, still as sure. My belly is full of the souls of your fellow mortals, Dovahkiin. Die now, and await your fate in Southern Guard. Lost Funt, you are too late, Alderaan. Dovahkiin, use Dragonrend if you know it.
land of Akatosh. Malagi Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you or anyone else. Then I am coming for you. You cannot prevail against me. I will outlast you, mortal. I will get you. Parthenax, his Lot Congrach. You truly have the voice of a Dova. Alduin's allies will think twice after this victory. Yeah, but I couldn't kill him. I couldn't kill him. He said something about not being able to kill him here, and then he escaped. Nili Vrachin Moro. True, this is not the final Krongra victory, but... Not even the heroes of old were able to defeat Alduin in open battle. Oh. Alduin always was Pahlok, arrogant in his power. Usnagar Par, he took domination as his birthright. This should shake the loyalty of the Dove who serve him. If, if I can't defeat him here, then I need to know where he's gone and defeat him there. Yes, one of his allies could tell us, Mat Mahus, but it will not be so easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps the Hafkasayun, the palace in Whiterun, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. Oh. A fine place to trap one of Alduin's allies, hmm? Yeah. Something else straight out of the past to help us. It's not like everything's coming full circle and, and, and the past again, isn't it? Um, oh, I'm not sure the Isle of Whiteman would like us using his palace, though. Hmm, yes, but your Soom is strong. I do not doubt that you can convince him of the need. We've got to go to Whiterun and catch ourselves a dragon. There has been talk amongst the guards that you are dragonborn. Yeah, that's but right. such a thing, surely that's not possible. No, they saw it themselves. The cousin of the Emperor was murdered in solitude at her own damn wedding. Yes, yeah, so not I a heard. chance we would have let that happen here. Hello, I'm back. What is it that you need? Yeah, I, I need your help to trap a dragon in your palace. Uh, I must have misheard you. No. I thought you asked me to help you trap a dragon in my palace. Yeah, I need to. It's the only way to stop the dragons. What you're asking for is insane. Yes. Impossible. No. You want me to let a dragon into the heart of my city with the threat of war on my doorstep? It's not the first time. Um, well... Yeah, I mean, there's that war that I keep hearing about, but um, that's not actually the worst threat, because the worst threat is Alduin's back and the world's going to end. Alduin? Yeah. The world eater himself? Yep. But how can we fight him? Me? Doesn't his return mean it's the end times? Well, sort of, except that I'm the Dragonborn and I can stop him. I don't know about such things, but I heard the Greybeard summon you. That's good enough for me. Now what's this nonsense about trapping a dragon in my palace? Well, it's... I've got to find Alduin um, before it's too late. 
because he's gone somewhere. Um, I couldn't kill him down here and he's gone somewhere and I've got to go there to be able to kill him um, but obviously he didn't say where he was going so I need to go and catch I need to catch one of his one of his dragons and because they'll know I want to help you dragonborn and I will but I need your help first oh god Ulfric and General Tullius are both just waiting for me to make a wrong move do you think they will sit idle while the dragon is slaughtering my men and burning my city? No. I can't risk weakening the city while we are under the threat of enemy attack. I'm sorry. Well, it's, it's not, it's not going to mean much if the world ends, because there won't be a city. Um, what if you didn't have to worry about an enemy attack? What if I sorted that out? Then... I would be glad to help you with your mad dragon trapping scheme, but getting both sides to agree to a truce will be difficult at this point. The bitterness has gone too deep. Maybe. Hmm. What of the Greybeards? They are respected by all Nords. High Hrothgar is neutral territory. If the Greybeards were willing to host a peace council, then maybe Ulfric and Tullius would have to listen. <laughs> yeah, the grey bits. Mm. Um, leave it to me, I'll sort them out. Aye, Dragonborn. Maybe you can stop the dragons and this war into the bargain. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. Yeah, well, you've got one. Alduin? We heard the Dragon Ren shout from here. You defeated him? Well, sort of. But, but he escaped, and I've got to find out where he's gone to. I feared as much. I thought it was him we saw flying east after your battle. Yeah, it was. Um, now, I'm going to need your help, because um, I've got to catch a dragon. We are not warriors. What is overlooked in the Dragonborn is not permitted to any other followers of the Way of the Voice. No, 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 no. Um, I don't mean that, that I want you to actually help me catch the dragon, but I, I just need your help to, to stop the war. You misunderstand our authority. The Greybeards have never involved themselves in political affairs. Um, yeah, but your Bargraf won't help me catch the dragon while the war's going on so the war needs to stop so I can catch the dragon and stop the end of the world I see <laughs> the dragon will lead you to Alduin but without the Jarl's help yeah so but both sides respect um, the Greybeards um, and they'll listen to you Parthenax has made the decision to help you this is the road we have to walk even the Greybeards must bend to the winds of change, it seems. So be it. Tell Ulfric and General Tullius that the Greybeards wish to speak to them. We will see if they still remember us. Uh, yeah, I'm sure they do. do. Do you... would you... could you make a guess as to where Alduin's actually gone? The old tales say that he can travel into Sovereign Guard to devour the souls of the dead. Oh, you must find that. out how he does this before he regains his strength and returns. Okay, so yeah, he did mention about devouring souls, so that must be where he, he's gone. Um, but that's that's the Nord place of where the dead go, and I'm not even Nord. All dead. Thank you, thank you. Sky above, voice within. Yes. The 
right answer. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. Don't be so sure. Y'all are frick. Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Yarl without sight. Do I know you? No, no, but um, I, I brought a message from the Greybeards. It's about time they turned their gaze from the heavens back to our bleeding homeland. What do they want? Right, probably not what you think. Um, they want to negotiate um, a truce so that we can deal with the well, so that I can deal with the dragons. I have the greatest respect for the Greybeards, of course. And the dragon attacks are a growing plague. But... The political situation is still delicate. Not all the Jarls are fully committed to supporting me as High King. I can't afford to appear weak. I can't agree to this unless Tullius himself will be there. Um, you're an Nord, you'll understand. Because um, the situation is pretty serious because Alduin's come back. Alduin? The world eater of song and legend? Yep. If that's true. Well, it changes the situation, doesn't it? Just Even Tullius may be forced to talk sense in the face of such a threat. So, you'll, you'll, you'll come? Yes. I'll give Tullius one more chance to quit Skyrim with his tail between his legs. And what would you have me do? If he's not with us, he's against us. <laughs> he knows that. Well, we've got to find General Tullius. By the gods, the Emperor has been murdered, on his own ship, moored in the inlet. It was the Dark Brotherhood. There was nothing we could do. So I heard. He'd be insane to try. It he doesn't have the men. We bring on. That's not what my scouts report, sir. Every day, Excuse me. Are my men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? Well, yes, I've got a message from the Greybeards. The Greybeards? Yeah. What do those old hermits want with me? Well, there's going to be a, a peace council at um, High Hrothgar. Why, there's nothing to discuss as long as that traitor Ulfric is in arms against his rightful emperor. Well, it'll be that as it may. Um, we need a truce so that um, I can deal with um, the Dragon Menace. They are getting to be a problem. But I wasn't sent to Skyrim to fight dragons. My job is to quell this rebellion, and I intend to do just that. Dragons or no dragons. Well, um, the Ulfric's actually already agreed to negotiate. Has he? Yeah. I suppose he doesn't want to miss a chance to bluster about the Empire's many crimes. I wouldn't have He's probably so. hoping I'll refuse so he can blame the Empire for being unreasonable. I think I'll have Something to disappoint like him yet again. So, you'll come? Yes, yes, fine. I'll come to this Greybeard Council. For all the good it will do. So, Arn Gear, is it? You know why we're here. Are you going to let us in or not? You are not invited here. You are not welcome here. We have as much right to be at this council as all of you. More, actually, since we were the ones that put the Dragonborn on this path. Were you? Hubris of the Blades truly knows no bounds. If it were up to you, the Dragonborn would sit dreaming on this mountain, doing nothing. Delphi, we are not here to rehearse your grudges. The matter at hand is urgent. Aldwin must be stopped. You wouldn't have called this council if you didn't agree. We know a great deal about the situation and the threat that Aldwin poses to us all. You need us here if you want this council to succeed. Ah, uh, very well. You may enter. So, oh, you've done it. The men of violence are gathered here, in these halls whose very stones are dedicated to peace. I should not have agreed to host this council. The 
Greybeards have no business involving ourselves in it such matters. It was the only way. It was the only way. Yes, yes. Which is why I allowed this violation of all our traditions. I'm sorry. But regrets are pointless. Here we are. Take your seat at the council table. And let no. us see what wisdom we can find among these warriors of Skyrim. No, Angir, I, Angir, people better than me. I've, I've got, to, I've got to go up to the mountain to get something, Angir. You deal with it without me. What? Right, they should have finished in there. By now, I'm going to go in and see what they figured out. But the difficulty remains. How to lure a dragon to Dragon's Reach at all? I believe I've identified one of the dragons that all of us must have. Okay, so how does that help? Ah, don't you see? The names of dragons are always three words of power. Shouts. By calling the dragon with a voice, okay. he will hear you wherever he might be. Right, he'll hear me, but, but why would he come? He's not compelled to, but dragons are prideful by nature and loath to refuse a challenge. Your voice in particular is likely to intrigue this dragon after your victory over Alderaan. I think it's very likely that he will be unable to resist investigating your call. Ah, okay. So what's his name? Ah, indeed. I'm no master voice, like these worthy gentlemen, but it is written here in this scroll. Oda Ving, winged snow hunter, as I read it. Wanderer, here to lick my father's boots. Good job. Yal, are we ready to trap a dragon? As I promised, my men stand ready. The great chains are oiled. We wait on your word. Well, let's do it. Let's catch ourselves a dragon. My men know what to do. Make sure you do your part. I'm putting my city in your hands. Something to say to the Jarl. Say it with your own tongue. Well, if we don't succeed, you're not going to have a city, so you better hope we succeed. Okay. Here. Yeah. Yeah, call him. I hear a dragon. Hear that? Oh, there we are.
here. Come back here. Have you killed Lydia? Need. I think it's holding. Her foot are made Kodav. Caught like a bear in a trap. Zokfrini grin kogra drun viki dovakin. Ah, I forget. You do not have the Dova speech. No. My eagerness to meet you in battle was my undoing, Dovakin. I salute your. Hmm. Low cunning in devising such a Gramin Dol stratagem. Not really mine. It was actually a dragon's. The Ubonar. You went to a great deal of trouble to put me in this humiliating position. In Sir Alduin, hmm? No doubt you want to know where to find Alduin. Oh yes, I want to know where he's hiding. Renik Vaza, an apt phrase. Alduin, Boval. One reason I came to your call was to test your thorn for myself. Okay, what did you think? Many of us have begun to question Alduin's lordship. Whether okay. his Thuum was truly the strongest. Among ourselves, of course, Muni Maie, none were yet ready to openly defy him. Yet ready. Anyway, you were saying where to find Alduin. Once Lord Croesus, innumerable pardons, I digress. He has traveled to Sovngarde to regain his strength, devouring the Silesure, the souls of the mortal dead, a privilege he jealously guards. Uh. His door to Sovngarde is at Skaldafin, one of his ancient fanes high in the eastern mountains. Okay. Binduran pa ok midove navarantil. I surely do not need to warn you that all his remaining strength is marshaled there. I'd be surprised if it wasn't. To Ulost Ofan Hinlan. Now that I have answered your question, you will allow me to go free? Well, I, I, I can't actually do that to Arduin's defeated. Ah, well. Hmm. Croesus. There is one detail about Skaldafin I neglected to mention. Okay. What is it? Only this. You have the Thurm of Adova. Yeah. But without the wings of one, you will oh. never set foot in Skaldafin. Of course, I could fly you there. But not while imprisoned like this. Oh, that would be a bit difficult. Okay. You fly me to Sk Skaldafin and I'll set you free. Onikan Korav Gain Mirad. It is wise to recognize when you only have one choice. This happens to me. And you can trust me. Zuni Tarudis. Alduin has proven himself unworthy to rule. I go my own way now. Free me, and I will carry you to Skaldafin. Incredible. Uh, sir, you have no idea how long I have waited for such an opportunity. I would be most appreciative if you would permit me to perform some, uh, Tests on you, purely in the interests of the advancement of knowledge. Be gone, mage. Do not test my promise to the Dover King. I'm glad you're on our side. What's a got dragon? Something to tell the grandkids, eh? Yeah, um... 
I don't think you're going to like this. What are you doing back there? Oh god, what's he up to? Uh, can you open the trap, please? You sure about that? You want to yes. let that dragon loose after all the trouble to catch him in there? Uh, yes, yes, yes. I, I, I'm, I'm sure. Otherwise, you're going to be minus the court mage. Your funeral. Someone else is going to have to help you get him back in there again. Get ready to open the trap. Right. I don't think he's going to fall for it twice. This seems like a really bad idea to me. Carry on, soldier. This is all part of the Dragonborn's plan. Yeah, we don't actually have another choice. All the gods. Was nu? Dini dein Rufe astwal. Saran Uf. I await your command as promised. Are you ready to see the world as only a Dova can? Yeah, I think of it as my, um, my birthright, even if I don't have wings. Take me to the Skaldathin. Zuk Britoth, I warn you, once you've flown the skies of Kaisal, your envy of the Dove will only increase. This is as far as I can take you. Griffoth Akrin. I will look for your return. Or Alduin's.
Okay, puzzles. Dolphin. only get here by dragon. in it. Yes, there is.
ですか今日はIsn't it an imperial being lord after? But I'm I'm Doverkin. Maybe I'm supposed to come here. Back, traveler. I can't. Terror waits within this mist. Many have braved the shadowed veil, but vain is all courage against the peril that guards the way. 
Okay, um, what's, what's all this horrible mist stuff? I do not know, but none have passed through. Alduin, his hunger insatiable, hunts the lost souls snared within this shadowed valley. Can you lead the way to where Shore's Hall waits, beckoning us on to welcome long sought? Okay, uh, what's Shore's Hall? Don't you know? No. What drew you here? Killer. Surely your dreams showed you the way. The Hall of Valor, where heroes wait to follow Shore to the final battle. Okay. I saw it fair when first I trod this long sought path. The pain and fear vanished, dreamlike, and a vision beckoned. Shore's Hall, shimmering across the clouded veil, but quenched was hope by the shrouding mist. My mind is darkened. I've lost the way, and wander blindly. Hurry, before Alduin your life devours. Bring word to Shore's Hall of our hard fate. I'll do that, yeah. Um, but don't don't worry. I'm I'm actually here to kill Alduin. Beware, the World Eater waits within the mist. Okay. Good. get to that then. What brings you, Wayfar Glen? A wanderer here in Sovngarde, soul's end. Shore's gift to honor dead. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm after Alduin. I'm gonna kill him. A faithful errand. No few have chafed to face the worm since first he set his soul snare here at Sovngarde's threshold. But Shore restrained our wrathful onslaught. Perhaps deep counsel. Your doom for song. I. Um. I. I don't really understand that. Is there someone in the hall that can help me? Can I go in? No shade are you, as usually here passes. But no, living, not dead. you dare the land of the dead. By what right do you request entry? Um, I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm the Dragonborn. Ah. It's been too long since last I faced a doom-driven hero of the Dragonland. What's your name? Does that... Does that mean I can go in? Living or dead, by decree of shore, none may pass this perilous bridge until I judge them worthy by the warrior's test. Oh god. Fools! 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 You fought well. I find you worthy. It is long since one of the living has entered here. May Shore's favor follow you and your heir.
I, 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 I think we're getting, I think we're getting a pass on that, don't we? This must be where all the Lord heroes go. Welcome, Dragonborn. Our door has stood empty since Alduin first set his soul snare here. By yes, Shaw's command, we sheathed our blades and ventured not the Vale's dark mist. But three await your word to loose their fury upon the perilous foe. Gormleth, the fearless, glad-hearted in battle. Hekan, the valiant, Heavy-handed warrior, Feldir the Old, I know those names. and grim. They're Parthenax's friends. They they invented Dragonrend. At long last, Alduin's doom is now ours to seal. Just speak the word, and with high hearts, you'll hasten forth to smite the worm wherever he lurks. Hold, comrades. Let us counsel take before battle is blindly joined. Alduin's mist is more than a snare. Its shadowy gloom is his shield and cloak. But with four voices joined, our valor combined. We can blast the mist and bring him to battle. I, I, I've got rid of the mist before. wisdom. The World Eater, coward, fears you, Dragonborn. We must drive oh, away no, his mist, shouting away. together, and then unsheathe okay. our blades in desperate battle with our black wing foe. To battle, my oh, friends! Escaped us yes, long ago. Yeah, come on. The eyes are sure upon you, this Defeat Alduin. Okay. Are we ready? We cannot fight the foe in this mist. Clear skies! Combine our shouts! Nog?
This was a mighty deed. The doom of Alduin encompassed at last, and cleansed his sovereign guard of his evil snare. They will sing of this battle in Shores Hall forever. But your fate lies elsewhere. When you have completed your count of days, I may welcome you again with glad friendship and bid you join the blessed feasting. I can come here. Oh, oh hail, hail the, the dragonborn! dragonborn. Hail, hail the herb with great praise. praise! Yes. And and I can I can I can come here and 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 people want me. I've done it, haven't I've, I've I've done it. I've I I I've saved I've saved the world. And that that didn't look like the 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 Elder Scroll putting him forward in time. But I didn't absorb his soul, it, 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 it went up there. I've, I've got to go back now. When you're ready to rejoin the living, just bid me so, and I will send you back. Yeah, I've, I've, got, to, I've, got, I've got to go back now, I've got to tell them that it's all okay. Return now to Nern, with this rich boon from shore, my lord. A shout to bring a hero from Sovngarde in your hour of need. Oh. No! It's done. It's done. Zorot for Kanaran. to himself, didn't he? Trying to destroy the world. Indeed. Alduin Wachlan Dani. His doom was written when he claimed for himself the lordship that properly belonged to Bormahu, our father Akatosh. Uh, Sak but I Akatosh. cannot celebrate his fall. Zutiraz Ach Ochma. He was my brother once. This world will never be the same. We 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 we. But it does that mean that you're not very happy with me? Because it's all I was doing was, was fulfilling my destiny as Dragonborn. Indeed, you saw more clearly than I. Certainly more clearly than Alduin. Rokhunta like Korav. Perhaps now you have some insight into the forces that shape the Benesetid, the currents of time. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Perhaps you begin to see the world as a Dova. Uh, but I forget myself. Krosis, Solos Midfadon. Melancholy is an easy trap for a Dover to fall into. Really? You have won a mighty victory, Shahroch Kondra. One that will echo through all the ages of this world, 
for those who have eyes to see. Savor your triumph, Tovakin. This is not the last of what you will write upon the currents of time. Goran, I feel younger than I have in many an age. Many of the Dovate are now scattered across Kizal. Without Alduin's lordship, they may yet bow to the Vazen, brightness of my Thun. But willing or no, they will hear it. Fare thee well, Dovakin. Oh, I know you. I wish the old one luck in his quest. But I doubt many will wish to exchange Alduin's lordship for the tyranny of Parthenax's way of the voice. I need to know more this way. As for myself, you've proven your mastery twice over. Thuri Dovakin, I gladly acknowledge the power of your thumb. Zu Odaving, call me when you have need, and I will come if I can. Delphine had a word with me before she left the Eclipse Conference, and, and she said that, that you deserve to die. The Blades are wise not to trust me. Only Khan Miov. I would not trust another Dova. Oh. Why shouldn't they trust you? Dov Walan Farel. We were made to dominate. The will to power is in our blood. You feel it in yourself, do you not? Well, yeah. I can be trusted. I know this, but they do not. Only Khan Niovdova. It is always wise to mistrust a Dova. I have overcome my nature only through meditation and long study of the way of the voice. No day goes by where I am not tempted to return to my inborn nature. Zimgriforvut se suyek. What is better, to be born good? or to overcome your evil nature through great effort. You got... You can teach me a lot, Parthenax, because I've killed without regret or even thinking about it. I better let the, other, I better let the others know that, that Alduin's gone, though... I think the dragons are basically telling everyone now. I can see it in your eyes. You've seen the land of the gods and returned. Does this mean it is done? Is Alduin truly defeated? Yes, yes. Yes, I went to Sovngarde, and, and I killed Alduin. At last! It is over. Perhaps it was all worth it in the end. You've shown yourself mighty, both in voice and deed. In order to defeat Alduin, you have gained mastery of dreadful weapons. Now it is up to you to decide what to do with your power and skill. Will you be a hero whose name is remembered in song? 
throughout the ages? Or will your name be a curse to future generations? Or will you merely fade from history, unremembered? Let the way of the voice be your guide, and the path of wisdom will be clear to you. Breath and focus, Dragonborn. Your future lies before you. Yes, I'm, I'm going to study the, the, the way of the voice, and, and I'm going to spend time with Parthenax um, and, and meditate on, on the mountain, because I have... I've done some really awful things and I think Parthenax will be able to help me because he knows. Um, I think I think the, the, the old fortune teller in, in White Run was partly right when she said that my home involves snow because I think I think this is my home and my, my dragon blood makes makes Parthenax my family. And, and this is where I'm going to stay. Sky above, voice within. Well, Parthenax, I'm ready for my first lesson. <laughs> <laughs>